All right, our next example, how many sides does a polygon have if the sum of its angle is 2,880? So when it says how many sides does a polygon have, we have to find n. We have to figure out what the value of n is. And then when it says the sum of its angles, they're talking interior angles, that's sum of interior angles. So we're going to use that formula. Sum of interior angles is equal to 180 times n minus 2. So this time, what we have, or what we know, is the sum, and we don't know n. So we're going to plug in that 2880 in for the s, for the sum. And we're going to write the rest of this, and we're going to solve this for n. So now it's just a basic algebra equation. Um, Any time that you have an equation that has parentheses, we've always distributed first. So you have 2,880 is equal to 180n minus 360. And now we're just going to solve the equation for n. So we will add 360 to both sides. That gives us 3240 is equal to 180n. And then you guys know how to get rid of the 180. We're just going to divide both sides by 180. And we get 18 is equal to n. So n equals 18, which makes this an 18-gon. That's what the polygon is. And let's see what the question asked us specifically. How many sides does a polygon have? So it has 18 sides. And if we were asked to name the polygon, we would call it an 18-gun.